James Franklin's running list of offensive coordinators continues, this time with someone who's no stranger to the Big Ten. Mike Yurcich was a grad assistant at Indiana before coming to the PSAC and working at Edinburgh and then Shippensburg. His resume at Shippensburg boosted him to a job at Oklahoma State for a few years, then Ohio State, back down south to Texas, and now in Happy Valley. I spoke to a few former Red Raiders excited to see Yurcich in the blue and white you're in the big 10 literally one of the one of the best conferences that, that, that college football has to offer and i think i think he's going to be an absolute phenomenal fit uh with with penn state penn state's new oc mike yursich brings a different style of offense to the table in 2011 his first season at shippensburg university trashes the wing t to a spread offense but it wasn't just his style it was his energy that stands out to players he's coached you, you drew to that level of energy that he that he had, that he has, that he carries with him all the time, that we had morning meetings every morning around 5.30 or 6 o'clock. And from that morning meeting, he, he was wired, ready to go. And in 2012, the Red Raiders makes it to the second round of the NCAA playoffs and their quarterback named to the most prestigious award in Division II, the Harlan Hill, just five PSAC players to ever win it. This was a team trophy. This was never an individual thing. You know, that season was insane. As he grew as a player, the Harlan Hill winner's biggest thing to the next QB under Yursich to listen. He is the smartest, the most passionate person I've ever been a part of. He knows football. Doesn't matter if they were a fan of the blue and white, they are now. I think Penn State is is on their way to, to greatness, and I and I I know I'll be uh, I'll be one of the loudest fans cheering for them for sure.